In late October, a concerned Virginia resident spotted a strange snake measuring roughly 10 to 12 inches long with a head shaped like a half moon. Unsure what it was, the individual called the Virginia Wildlife Management and Controls Snake Identification Hotline, sending over a video of the bizarre creature. They identify thousands of snakes every year, but the problem is, they had never seen anything like it before and were not sure if it was a freak of nature. They were so confused as to the creepy crawler's species, they put out a public call for tips. Eventually, the group figured out that the odd creature was a hammerhead worm. The species is a large, invasive pest and extremely difficult to kill. Hammerhead worms may not look that exciting, but they have an astonishing superpower, regeneration. When bits of them are amputated, these bits can regrow into complete worms, even from snipped-off fragments that represent a very small section of their body. The worms, along with other members of the giant flatworm species, reproduce asexually and are able to produce tons of worm children without a partner. They also taste terrible. Land flatworms generate chemicals that give them an unpleasant taste. Hammerhead worms, which are native to Asia, are thought to have come to the U.S. by hitchhiking across plant trade routes. The hammerhead worm is a terrifying, toxic terrestrial flatworm. This large planarian lives on land and is both a predator and a cannibal. While the distinctive-looking worms don't pose a direct threat to human beings, they're an invasive species that packs the power to eradicate earthworms. The most distinctive features of the hammerhead worm are its fan or spade-shaped head and long, flattened body. The underside of the planarian has a large creeping sole used for locomotion. Species are differentiated by the shape of the head, size, coloration, and stripe pattern. The terrestrial planarians are earth-colored, found in shades of gray, brown, gold, and green. Small hammerhead worms ranges from 5 to 8 centimeters in length. In contrast, adult worms can exceed 20 centimeters in length. A hammerhead worm tracks its prey, pushes it against a surface, and entangles it in slimy secretions. Once the prey is mostly immobilized, the worm extends its pharynx from its body and secretes digestive enzymes, then sucks liquefied tissue into its branched gut using cilia. When digestion is complete, the worm's mouth also serves as its anus. While some types of worms are edible, the hammerhead worm is not among them. The planarian contains the potent neurotoxin, tetrodotoxin, which the worm uses to immobilize prey and deter predators. The toxin is also found in pufferfish, the blue-ringed octopus, and rough-skinned newts, but was not known to occur in any species of terrestrial invertebrate prior to its discovery in the hammerhead worm. I hope you have enjoyed this video. If you have, please subscribe to this YouTube channel and don't forget to give this video the thumbs up. And I'm sure you're going to enjoy this next video on Invasion of the King Crab. Thanks for watching and bye for now.